While Intel remains a prominent choice for high-end CPUs, there is now a wide range of options to consider from AMD as well. Among these choices, the AMD Ryzen 7 7800X3D stands out as the powerful upper mid-range CPU. Let's say you're going to build a gaming PC and considering going for either of these two. Which one would make more sense? Let's compare them head-on and find out. Looking for an animation studio that can turn your story or idea into animated visuals? Look no further than 10 Studio. Our team of experts creates animated explainer videos that simplify complex ideas and bring your message to life. Our experience can help you tell your story in a way that engages your target audience and makes them remember it. Don't miss out on this opportunity to stand out from your competition. Visit our website to know more at www.10.studio. The Core i9-13900K from Intel includes 24 cores and 32 threads, while Ryzen 7 7800X3D has only 8 cores and 16 threads. Just like Intel's higher cores and threads, the processor also features a boosted clock speed of 5.4 GHz, while the Ryzen 7 7800X3D comes with a maximum of 5 GHz boosted frequency. As we can see, the Core i9-13900K looks more prominent than the Ryzen 7 7800X3D if we count the higher numbers of cores and threads. However, 7800X3D takes the lead in gaming, thanks to the 3D vCache. According to at Tom's Hardware, the 3D cache technology from AMD combines a 3D stacked cache chipset with the processor resulting in top-tier gaming performance, but a trade-off with productivity applications. While it significantly boosts performance in certain games, not all titles experience the same benefit. Subsequently, the fastest Intel gaming chip Core i9-13900K did not manage to take the lead against the Ryzen 7 7800X3D chip. To see how fast the AMD chip is, let's take a look at the At Hardware Times Gaming Benchmark. Here, they tested both these CPUs at 720p resolution with RTX 4090 GPU in order to reduce any possible GPU bottlenecks. When running a Plague Tale Requiem at 720p Ultra settings without ray tracing enabled, the i9-13900K achieves an average of 199 FPS while the Ryzen 7 7800X3D falls slightly behind at 190 FPS. It appears that in this particular game, the X3D chip did not receive the significant boost it was expected to have compared to the i9-13900K. This aligns with our earlier observation that not all titles experience the same benefits. The results are similar when ray tracing is turned on, with Intel maintaining the lead with an average of 138 FPS while the 7800X3D achieves around 123 FPS. However, the situation changes in recent game titles, where the X3D chip outperforms the i9-13900K. For example, in Dying Light 2 at 720p Ultra settings, Ryzen 7 7800X3D achieved around 297 average FPS without RT and approximately 222 average FPS with RT while the 13900K scored 235 and 123 FPS respectively. Similarly, in Cyberpunk 2077, the Ryzen 7 7800X3D displayed impressive performance with an average FPS of 174 without RT and 133 with RT. In comparison, the Core i9-13900K lagged behind with 148 FPS without RT and only 99 FPS with RT. Besides, in other benchmark games, AMD consistently took the lead, showing its superiority over Intel in various gaming scenarios. There is a noticeable performance gap between the Core i9-13900K and Ryzen 7800X3D when it comes to gaming. Though it might not be significant overall, the Ryzen 7 7800X3D clearly stands out as a faster gaming CPU. However, if your primary focus is on productivity and work tasks, then the Core i9-13900K is the superior choice. 
So that was all about the Intel Core i9-13900K versus Ryzen 7 7800X3D debate. Catch you guys on our next video.